the mind needs a place to settle down. Otherwise, it just wanders around in its thoughts. And John Lee's image is of an airplane that doesn't have a landing field. You fly around and around and around, and you finally crash into the mountains, crash into the forest, because you don't have a place to land. So you take the breath as your place to land. That way, as you scout around, you know you've got a good, safe place to come back to. It's not that the Buddha tells us not to think, that we do think in, in the meditation. And there are the things we have to think about as we go through life. But there needs to be a still place where we can think about the stillness, think about resting the mind. Because otherwise it gets frazzled. When it gets frazzled, then it can't think straight. And when it can't think straight, it makes all kinds of wrong decisions about what to do or say and think. So work on building your, your airstrip here. Get to know the body really well, get to know the breath really well, so that when the mind is agitated, the breath, breath can calm it down. When the mind is sluggish, the breath can be used to give it more energy. And as you get interested in the breath, you realize that it affects all the other processes in the body. You get fascinated by what the breath can do in the body. You have a pain in some place or an illness in another place, you can use the breath energy to help make heavy cases light and make light cases go away. So there's a lot to be done here, building this airstrip. And it's you don't just build the airstrip and wait, someday maybe I'll be able to get to settle down and land here. You're here right with the body as you're working with it. And that gives the mind at least some fence around its activity so it's not wandering too far off. And then gradually it settles in, settles in, and finally it gets to feel that it really belongs here. Then you fly away only when you need to, and you come back, and you've got a good, safe place to come back to. So work on making this landing strip really safe. Make sure there are no obstacles inside here. A landing strip with obstacles on, scattered all around is not going to be a good place to land. So when there's discomfort in the body or weird thoughts come up and you learn how to avoid them, whatever else comes up in the present moment, you learn how to deal with it skillfully as you get the mind to settle in. Some people get really impatient. They say, I've been doing it for years and years, and I can't get the mind to settle down. Well, there's work to be done. And if you don't do the work now, when are you going to do it? So work on it now. That way the mind will be safe. <laughs>